the all-star festivities always a great show we'll be back to get this thing started after this we're here in seattle the 2023 mlb all-star game coming at you on the show it's the national league all-stars taking on the american league all-stars joined by my partner chris singleton I'm John Chambi. Singy, always special when we get together to call the All-Star Game. Well, we've done a lot of these together, and sometimes you come in and think, ho-hum, another year. But once you look and you see these All-Star players, their uniforms on, them interacting with one another, you realize just how special it is. It's going to be a great one tonight. First pitch coming at you right after the break. Just about set to go. And today's starting pitcher, Garrett Cole. What should we keep an eye on here? Power pitcher. He's going to speed you up with the fastball velocity. And out of his hand will explode the breaking ball. Very difficult for hitters to keep that front side closed and hit the ball the other way. Because they know if they're not ready to pull the trigger, the fastball will beat them. And first offering is fouled off. First pitch, 1 o'clock. Ground ball right side. The flip to the pitcher covering. And Acuna retired. Batting second. From the Los Angeles Dodgers. The right fielder. Mookie. Here's Mookie now. He has, yes. as they like to say, light tower power. Not a big guy, but a big swing. And thunder in that bat. To the right side. Guerrero takes it himself and a couple of quick outs batting third from the St. Louis Cardinals the first baseman and here's Paul Goldschmidt Paul Gold Chris Smith. Paul Goldschmidt has turned into a really good player for a guy who was an eighth round pick in 2009 at a Texas State many all-star appearances silver sluggers and then in 2022 an MVP oh. And the first pitch misses for ball one. Yeah, and several years he was in the running for MVP. Just some better talent in the league at that time. But I love the combo of a real solid hitter at the plate, but also a guy with some speed that can steal some bases. A little surprising for a first baseman. One and two, Swing and a miss. And the count, one and two. Foul ball still, a one and two count. The wide to kick the pitch. Stop. A little bit low. Really good take, especially with two strikes. Bryce Harper on deck for the National League. The pitch. Some heat there at 98 miles an hour. We head to the bottom of the first. And now the American League with their opportunity to shine. No score. Back here at the ballpark. And starting in this one, Sandy Alcantara. Well, he comes at hitters with a five-pitch mix. So for him, it's always interesting to see how he utilizes those weapons. He may lean on one or two pitches, depending on how things are going and how things are working. But if he can control four or even five of those offerings, look out, hitters. It's going to be a tough day. He's really going to be able to keep those guys off balance. And he deals. Here's a swing and a drive left field, and he knew it. Jose Altuve will touch them all. And they grab the lead. It's 1-0. Power versus power right there. Like two locomotives colliding. Who's going to win? 
Well, a really good job there by the hitter getting the top hand working. Powers that fastball out of here. Here's Mike Trout. In the air to left center. Acuna after it. Then there's one down. Batting third. From the New York. Here is Aaron Judge. The right fielder. This guy is an elite level hitter, especially yeah. considering contact, just the ability to hit for average. What you really like, though, stays in against those righties, and that's not so easy as a right-handed batter. Rip to third and caught. Nothing you can do about those as a hitter. Even though you know that, they Matty still Cole. drive you absolutely Rondon. crazy. Here's Jordan Alvarez. That's a dated hitter. Jordan Alvarez. And the first pitch misses for ball one. Alvarez, who's from Cuba, he grew up idolizing a future teammate, Yuli Gurriel, who is 13 years his senior. One and one. That one ripped. And that ball is out of here. Jordan Alvarez blasts one out. And they boost their lead. It's 2-0. almost robbed the home run right there and I tell you what he'd love another crack at it during batting practice you always like to work on that and so close but that one was just out of his reach now here's Giancarlo Stanton swinging a foul over the screen and back out of play Two as he waves at that one. Well, that's today's style of baseball right there, right? Big time velo on the bump and big time pop at the plate. Swings and misses, struck him out. But the long ball was working in this inning. Not once, but twice. It's now a two nothing ball game. And welcome back. And now here is Harper. The designated hitter. Well, after putting up a nice inning on offense, got some runs across. This is where you look for the starter to go out there, have a shutdown inning. Don't give that other team any hope. Uh, you just hope that he can get through this inning, get the bats back up there while they're hot. Now the Owan. Swings and lines a base hit into left field. So a man on base to start the inning. Love how he let that ball travel. Trusted his hands. Nice job of going the other way. The third baseman. Manny Machado. Manny Machado up to the plate. First offering, and it just misses. There's a strike. I think it was sitting off speed right there because he just let the fastball go by. Time to check on our umpires. Earl Hendricks calling balls and strikes. Yeah, well-liked umpire, Boog. Pretty consistent with his zone, so if you're familiar with him and how he works, you won't get too surprised by anything. Sometimes he'll give a little bit off the corner, but nothing too crazy at all. Swings through it, and that's a strikeout. That's a pretty nasty pitch right there. I'd call it a power curveball in the 80s. It's got so much spin on it, and you really don't have a lot of time to sit back and watch what it's going to do. 
before you have to come in. It was a good one for the swing and strikeout. Trey Turner now. And that one just misses a ball and no strikes. Lifted in the air out to left. Stanton hauls it in, and there's two away. Here's Jack Peterson. Seven. Seven. This lineup's going to have to find a way to make him work a little harder out there on the mound. I mean, he is just mowing them down. He's settling in. You've got to make him uncomfortable. Maybe step out of the box, call timeout, do whatever it takes. Harper off of first with two away. Going to count one and two. And he can't come up with it. But in time, nice job to stay with it to end the inning. One hit, one left. Now to the bottom of the second. The AL leads it two to nothing. Welcome back. Vladimir Guerrero Jr. now. The first baseman. Vladimir Guerrero Jr., he's made that proud so far in his career. Multiple all-star appearances. A guy who was born in Montreal way back when, 1999, when his dad was playing for the Expos. Yeah, and so much violence with that swing. Exit velocity is charged and very fun to watch. More plate discipline than dad. Throws across the diamond, and Guerrero is set down. The third baseman. Now it's Devers at the plate. Devers, Devers the baby-faced assassin. And first offering is fouled off. Alcantara, the reigning Cy Young Award winner, he features a changeup, a sinker, a four-seamer, a slider, and he occasionally uses a curve. Peterson makes the grab, two down. Batting eight. From the six. Here's Tim the Anderson. Not shortstop. Tim Anderson. Up the middle, Turner. And that'll do it. One, two, three goes the AL. They're up to nothing. Back at T-Mobile Park, Leading Wilson Contreras now up to the plate. The catcher, Wilson Contreras. And a pitch. And a foul ball. A healthy cut, tough pitch at 98, but a really good pass at the ball. And now the count is even. And that's downstairs and outside. That one fouled off, two and two. And a pitch. Inside, just missed. Knocks that one away, and we'll do it again. Three, two. Fights it off, you'll see another. The 3 2 is off the outside edge, and that is ball four. Well, a great back and forth, and that at bat. He had to lay off some really close pitches, and somehow Boogie found a way to keep the bat on his shoulder right there. I'll tell you right now, I couldn't have done it. Jazz Chisholm Jr. in the box here lets that one go for a ball. Now, these guys definitely looking for a big swing of the bat right here. Try to. And there's the strike. I think he was sitting off speed there. Down and in, moved his feet. He 
And that is in for a strike. Two and two. Runner at first with no outs here. Swing and a miss. Struck him out. Pulled the string on the changeup. Tell you what, those are the types of guys pitchers really like to punch out when they're on the mound because if they get on, just the distraction that they create with all that speed over on the base pass, it could take away your focus from the next hitter, and that's the last thing you want to do is serve up a pitch that a guy hits over the fence, and it's a multi-run home run. Acuna in the box now. Takes strike one. Grounded out his first time up. Misses outside. One ball, one strike. Swing and a miss, and that's one strike two. two. I'd say that stayed in the tunnel for a long time. No chance of even fouling it off. Now he can't squeeze it behind the plate. No advance. Good job behind the dish. The 2 2 now. That's inside. That's a really good take. Contreras over at first with one away. To third might be two. There's one, and that's two. Well, we can never overstate it. Pitcher's best friend right there. Double play, gets out of the jam, saves some pitches. Back here at the ballpark, bottom of the inning, and here's the catcher, Alejandro Kirk. Alejandro. Alcantara back to work. High in the air, out to right. Betts settles underneath it, hauls it in for the out. Now batter, the second baseman, Jose. Here's the former MVP, Jose Altuve. The solo homer his first time. Alcantara in his fifth season, 27 years old, and of course, He's the reigning NL Cy Young Award winner. That misses the zone. Ball one. Boog, it looks like somebody missed the swing sign. That's the first pitch this team's taken for a ball all game long. There's a swing and a drive. It bangs off the wall. Altuve into second, and he's got it double. Well, that'll make you feel good as a hitter right there. Nice line drive to the pole side right there, but he didn't spin off of it. That's the key. You still have to extend through the baseball in order to hit a line drive like that. Here's Trout. 0 for 1 so far. And it's fouled away. The pitch in the air right field pretty well struck Betts ranging back in the air to make the catch runner tags and will move up to third well I think the wind ended up being a factor right there it's whipping in from right field right now so otherwise I think that falls out of here it's Aaron Judge now he's over one singing he's got a history of coming through in the big spots I know I like to talk about I'm not sure whether clutch actually exists but you look at the numbers and this guy always seems to deliver in those spots first pitch doesn't find the zone well I think it's the ability to assess the situation understanding what the pitcher has what he's trying to get people out on and then being able to use the entire field tapped out in front of the plate to first oh. what a play to end the inning no runs one hit a double no errors and one man left on to inning number four. The AL out front here, two to nothing. Back in Seattle, now it's the right fielder, Mookie Betts. The right fielder, Mookie Betts. The pitch. Just missed. And that one almost got him. And the righty deals. That one's spoiled, and the count now two and one. 
And the right-hander deals. Just misses with that one. Now in this three ball count, down in the ball game, you've got to be very selective. Take your walk if they'll give it to you. And there's ball, ball four. four. Take your base. That could jumpstart an offense that's really struggled to score in this one. We don't want to wake a team up with the free pass. The first base now it's Goldschmidt up to the plate. Caught looking his first time up. Ball one, no strikes. This one popped up. Foul ground, first base side. Guerrero makes the catch, one down. Couple of pitches and a quick out. Here's Harper now. Beautiful swing in his last at bat, opposite field knock. And that's in there for strike one. Betts at first, one gone. And now it's one even one. up. Puts it in the air out towards left center. Long run, tracks it down. Two down. Every day during batting practice, these outfielders get about 10 minutes of balls in the gaps. They practice this, and when the game comes, they make the play perfect. Here's Manny Machado now. He was a strikeout victim his first time. Center field, Anderson on the move. Makes the grab on the run, and that will end the inning. And L leaves one, and they're down 2-0. Ready to go, bottom Leading four. Now it's Jordan League, Alvarez. The designated hitter, Jordan And Alvarez. the pitch. That one the other way. Peterson squeezes it, one down. Sometimes you want to be aggressive early in the bat. He was right there, hard line out, first pitch of the inning. No reward, but hey, you got to keep swinging it. Here's Stanton now. His first at bat was a strikeout. And he swings and misses no at the initial offering. Something I'm noticing in this one is that these guys are aggressive early in the count. It makes you wonder if that was talked about in the hitters meeting before this game started. And a foul ball. One down, base is empty. And one ball. and two. One, two. In the dirt. Already two gone here in the home fourth. You know, Boog, you often think a slider is more for that horizontal reason. movement, but most of the good ones have both vertical depth and that horizontal movement, and that's what we saw right there. Good drop on the break and got him to swing over the top. Two outs, base is empty. Here's Vladimir Guerrero Jr. And first offering is fouled off. And a foul ball left side. This guy's seen two change-ups in a row. Could be a little vulnerable for a fastball right here. Hard hit left side. Over to Goldie. And Guerrero is set down. Third out. Nothing doing there for the American League. But they hold the 2-0 lead. And welcome back. Here Trey we Turner at the plate. The shortstop. Turner. The pitch. Foul ball. Next offering is foul back.
Owen Chu now. Turner pops it up. And they get Turner for the out. And a quick out number one. The left fielder, number 23. John. And Jack Peterson stands Peterson. in. Grounded out his first time. Well, on the mound, very efficient. Able to produce an outcome, it seems like, within the third or fourth pitch of just about every bat. Next pitch is popped up. Cole drifts towards it. Makes the catch for the out. That was a good pitch to hit right down the heart of the plate. Had pretty good timing on it. Just got underneath it a little bit and popped it up. And up to hit is Wilson Contreras. He reached out a walk his first time. And that's in for a strike. Not what he's looking for there in the 0-0 count. Looks like he wants the ball down in the zone. And that one hammered back there. And it one hops the wall. And that's a double. Put a really nice balanced swing on it. And when you can rope one into the gap like that, you're thinking extra bases from the first couple of steps out of the box. And he'll feel real good about that one. Jazz Chisholm Jr. now. 0 for 1, he struck out swinging last time. That one pushed foul. Runner at second, two down. Oh, and two now. Just oh. missed. It's a good take. The next offering oh. misses. And the count's even two, at two. two. Great job of laying off those pitches down in the zone to even the count up at two and two. Such a better feeling for the hitter. Next pitch That's is ball. outside. Big pitch coming right here. Yeah. Last thing he wants to do is put the tying run on base, but he can't groove one either. Fly ball down the line. Judge is under it. And he's got it. Ball game. And the American League All-Stars get a shutout on the mound. Kind of a strange win. Only three hits. So they definitely weren't fired on all cylinders there. Great pitching. Really kept them in it and gave them a chance. 2-0 your final here in this one. For Chris Singleton and our entire outstanding crew here at MLB The Show, I'm John Shambi. We'll see you soon. Our final line score for the victorious American League All-Stars.